Hey guys, we're here in Mexico where preparations are in full swing for the massive Day of the Dead celebration. We're here checking out the real life party that's inspired Disney's massive new animation, Coco. So Adrian, we're here in San Miguel de Allende for Day of the Dead. Everyone's preparing for the celebration. Yes, yeah, we're here right outside the market right now. It's getting very busy. You can buy all sorts of stuff. I was wondering if you could talk us through some of the things here that are similar to what are in the film. Well, in the film, you'll see that Miguel puts up an ofrenda to their loved ones. It's like an altar. And on the altar, you want to put stuff that they loved in life because they're coming on a long journey from the land of the dead to provide for, for the family that's coming back. You'll see a lot of these beautiful uh, marigold flowers. That's a really important flower for the, for the Day of the Dead, so it's really colorful, it's really energetic, and if you keep their stories alive, if you keep them close to your heart, the connection is maintained and it lives on forever. Awesome, well should we go inside and take a look? I'd love to, let's do it. Preparations are well underway for the Day of the Dead celebration here in Mexico. We're here at a school to find out how the kids prepare for it. You excited guys? So it's the Day of the Dead here in the school and all the children are dressed up in their traditional Day of the Dead costumes. They've made a friender's and they've made arts and crafts. Now we're on our way to a cemetery and we're going to learn all about the real life Mexican customs. There are a lot of elements both visually, musically, that are based in Mexico. Some of them that you might recognize from the tradition are the ofrenda, this altar that you put up to honor the person that you're remembering. This place behind us is called Guanajuato and it's one of the places that inspired the look of Coco and you can see from all the brightly colored houses. Now we're going to have a go at building our own ofrenda, which is basically a traditional Mexican altar that you build for Day of the Dead. And you decorate it with flowers and food and candles and photos and as many marigold petals as you can get your hands on. The path of marigold petals, that's a real thing that we saw when we visited all these different towns. But it's the type of thing that can inspire a moment like Miguel crossing this beautiful marigold bridge to uh, reconnect with his ancestors. After all the preparations, we're here in the town square and everyone is ready to celebrate Day of the Dead. All the locals are here, tourists are here, everyone's celebrating together. Let's go and join the party. So we've seen all the colorful buildings, we've joined in with the Day of the Dead celebrations and we've even seen our own mariachi band. Now I think it's time to go and watch the film. See you at cinema.